Thanks for joining us tonight at 7. I'm Kelly Swoop. Well, in a bid to cut down on gun violence, Baltimore County has launched a shot spotter pilot program and it may already be paying off. WMAR 2 News' Jeff Hager takes a closer look so far at the results. In its first week of operation here in Essex and in the Wilkins precincts, Baltimore County Police have responded to three shot spotter alerts. Well, we're already seeing some success under this pilot project, but we're going to take a look at the numbers. We're going to see the impact it's had, whether it's brought about a meaningful impact on the community and our crime fight, and then make a decision at that point. The promise of the pilot program funded with three quarters of a million dollars in federal grant money is response times. The sooner officers can arrive on a shooting scene, the better the chance of catching the gunman or of saving the life of a shooting victim. Critics of the gunshot detection system question its effectiveness since it's far from an exact science. While the software is supposed to distinguish between gunshots and a vehicle backfiring or fireworks, there can be false alerts. The county chose Essex and Wilkins for the sensors because of a higher number of gun violence incidents, especially those involving juveniles in those areas. In a written statement, County Executive Johnny Olszewski's press secretary, Erica Palmisano, says, quote, this pilot will be one of several tools in our toolbox, joining other common sense measures like expanded cameras, license plate readers, and other technology, which the county will explore and deploy to combat violence and to keep our communities safe. In Baltimore County, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.